Hello there, welcome back to Little Cypress Gaming. Today we got something special in store for you. A complete guide of setting up a perfect home for one of the most intriguing and beautiful fish in the hobby, the Tiger Shower Nose. Before we dive in, make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell. <laughs> Alright, let's get started. The first step in setting up a tiger shower nose tank is choosing the right aquarium. These fish can grow quite large, so opt for a tank that's at least 150 gallons or more to accommodate their size. But I set up their tank in a 15 gallon tank. So why am I keeping them in a 15 gallon tank? Where is the zero? Well, that's the reason why these two fish are still about 3 inches in size. I also have 7 inches size silver avana in my 150 gallon aquarium. So there's a size difference between my silver avana and our new friend, tiger shower nose catfish. It's getting risky raising these two small fish alongside the silver avana. Once they grow a bit more, I'll be able to put all of them in the same tank. Now, let's talk about substrate and decor. Tiger shower nose catfish are bottom dwellers, so a sandy substrate is ideal. This will mimic their natural habitat and prevent any potential injuries to their delicate barbels. Adding ripwood, rocks and PVC pipes create hiding spot and territories. Make sure there are plenty of hiding places as these fish can be quite shy. Now I put my water pump between these two rocks. I don't put a bunch of rocks in this setup, I just add a few stones. You see, if the small tank is overly decorated, it can actually harm the fish. Filtration and water quality are crucial. Invest in a powerful filtration system to maintain pristine water conditions. Tiger shower nose catfish are sensitive to poor water quality, so regular water changes are a must. Aim for a pH level around 6.5 to 7.5 and a water temperature between 75 degrees to 82 degrees Fahrenheit. Remember to put in your aquarium heat and thermometer. Here are our two little buddies. <laughs> I am gonna keep them in this tiny tank for a bit. They seem so adorable, but a little stressed. Actually, their nose looks like a shower. <laughs> so cute there. Yeah. Now it's time to acclimate. Now it's time to put our fish into the tank. I grabbed this rock that was here before. So folks, this right here is our fish tank. Uh, it might not be the biggest or fanciest one out there, but I want you to get a good sense of it. The water is crystal clear and our little fish buddies are thriving there. Everything's okay. Now let's talk about the feeding. The tiger shower nut catfish are carnivorous predators. They lead a variety of foods including pallets, frozen and live foods like feed a fish or shrimp. Provide a balanced diet to keep them in healthy. Here I give them nice to clean frozen shrimp and I also give them pellets. Remember not to overfeed as excess food can pollute the water. Keep an eye on your catfish behavior and health. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, leave your questions and suggestions in the comments below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video and take care.